Hello, everyone. Thank you so much for joining us today for a very exciting Norwegian Cruise Line webinar. My name is Anna. I'm an Industry Relations Specialist here at CLIA, and I'm going to just quickly go through some housekeeping before introducing our presenter. The webinar will run about 45 minutes with time for questions at the end. Please feel free to type your questions into the questions module of the webinar, and we'll get to them at the conclusion of the presentation. This webinar is being recorded and will be posted on CLIA's YouTube channel, which is CLIA Global. And with that, it's my pleasure to introduce our presenter, Zach Caravetta. A 25-year veteran with Norwegian Cruise Line, Zach has worked in a variety of sales leadership capacities. Presently, he is the Senior Director of Agency Sales and Service, where he oversees a team of 11 business development managers and directors working from the headquarter office in Miami, Florida, dedicated to providing business development support for 13 of the largest host and franchise networks throughout the U.S. In addition, he directs a team of service and operations specialists providing internal sales support for all field sales throughout North America. And with that, take it away, Zach. Well, thank you so much, Anna. I uh, truly appreciate that. And I thank everybody who uh, took the time out to tune in. Um, I know it's a very busy time of the year. Uh, we consider the fourth quarter of the year one of the most critical times for really all of us with the intent to build momentum as we're fast approaching our wave season. And we know that's the all important first quarter of the year. But we really feel strongly at Norwegian Cruise Line that to have a successful wave season, it truly takes advanced preparation to have a good plan in place. So the purpose today is to really help everybody tuning in to be wave ready. That's kind of the motto at our corporate office right now. And uh, for us, that means hoping to help you find the, the right type of customer to drive interest and demand through your office this wave season. And that right type of customer is that person that's really focused on the destination and the experience and the value of the vacation. Because value conscious customers, we believe, will offer you the loyalty and profitable business for years to come. So tonight, today we're going to highlight a couple of simple, hopefully clear ways of being wave ready with some tools to consider and then perhaps even more so take advantage of uh, the thing that really drives more momentum than anything and that's building new ships. And we're so excited to introduce our newest ship which is forthcoming and that is Norwegian Encore. Uh, Norwegian Encore, as many of you may know or are familiar with the breakaway class ships, Encore is our final performance in that series of vessel. And this has provided us the opportunity for some of the most successful rollouts that we've introduced, most recent being Norwegian Bliss and Norwegian Joy. This November starts an Eastern Caribbean uh, departures from Miami, and we believe that Norwegian Encore is the perfect option for uh, multi-generational travelers, families, millennials, baby boomers, you name it. So we're excited to introduce more of the features and make sure you're ready and familiar with what Norwegian Encore brings to your customer base. So with Norwegian Encore, we wanted to start off with the activities because there is just so much to do and see, probably too much to see on a standard seven-day cruise but we're really hoping to just take it up to another level. We introduced um, one of the staple products that we got a lot of attention in over the last two ship builds has been the racetrack. And you'll see that on the webinar as well. On Norwegian Encore, it's going to feature an 1,100-foot multi-level track. This isn't just like go-karts. This is a competitive racing venue. These cars are electric. They go over 30 miles an hour. And on Encore, which is going to be a little bit different, some of the curves on the track actually suspend approximately 13 feet off the side of the track. And another new feature with the racetrack is the spectators actually get to interact a little bit where they can select their racer of choice that's, that's driving and they can give racers a boost of speed um, remotely. And then you'll see on the top of the, uh, of the screen, um, there's there's something that's covering the back quarter of the outdoor deck. And guests are going to find what we call kind of our interpretation of the lost city of Atlantis for an amazing laser tag experience um, with what we've included, an augmented reality technology through the laser tag obstacle course. Now, 
You may have heard of virtual reality. If you're not familiar with augmented reality, it's kind of embedding a virtual reality within the real life experience of where people are walking through. And if you want any more tips on it, because I haven't seen it myself yet, probably there's a teenager you know that can tell you a little bit more about it in their gaming experience. But it's great fun for families, friends, group activities. It's just taking this activity to another level. Um, you'll see the picture of the lady actually playing with a, um, she's got a virtual reality headset. Um, that is introducing on this ship, our second vessel, the Galaxy Pavilion. We introduced it on Norwegian Joy, and for those not familiar, the Galaxy Pavilion is approximately a 10,000 square foot video gaming center. It includes an interactive a gaming theater where friends get to join in and compete amongst one another. New on Encore, we're introducing a virtual reality escape room. So if you've ever had the fun of participating in an escape room live and in person, there's gonna be a virtual reality version of it. There'll be a VR hand glider, race car, and a design your own roller coaster, and just so much more. And then last, kind of a standard on many of our breakaway class ships are some of the largest and most thrilling water parks we, uh, we believe at sea. Um, the Encore is gonna feature tandem water slides and these very fast drop slides that extend you off the side of the ship in a clear tube that you can actually see or you try to see because you're whizzing by so fast. And of course, on any of our pool decks, we have some of those places to just kind of chill out poolside with a frozen drink in a hand if your thrill rides are not your thing. And always known for Norwegian with our expansive dining selections, we wanted to talk through a little bit about the complimentary and specialty dining options that are available to you. It continues the uh, tradition of our wide variety of complimentary and specialty dining, but this time on Norwegian uh, Encore, we're going to be introducing a new restaurant venue, which is called Onda by Scarpetta. The Scarpetta brand is known for really a comfortable, relaxed, but yet elegant modern Italian cuisine. Um, Scarpetta, the brand actually received a James Beard nomination for the best new restaurant in America. So on board Norwegian Encore, our restaurant Onda is going to combine signature pastas, seafoods, and much more. In addition to Encore is going to offer many of the other uh, restaurant selections introduced on Bliss and Joy, such as the American Diner, Los Lobos, which has the fr fresh tableside guacamole, Q, which is our Texas barbecue smokehouse, our Food Republic, which is a sample fusion of cuisine from all around the world with more of an appetizer sized portions via iPad ordering. And then we have some of our classic favorites the guests have known to love over the years, such as Cagney Steakhouse, La Bistro, and Teppanyaki. Some of our venues, of course, are going to offer indoor and outdoor dining by waterfront, which has been exceptionally popular since we introduced a waterfront on board several years ago and several vessels ago. It's just another way to connect our guests to the sea more than ever before, and this time within bar and restaurant opportunities. Plus, Norwegian Encore is going to feature our 24-hour pub we call The Local. There's going to be a, a chocolate shop called Coco's Gelato and Bakery, and of course, the ever popular Starbucks coffee to get your day started. Moving along to Norwegian Cruise Lines Entertainment on board Encore, we believe it's going to be second to none as we continue to pride ourselves on offering our guests the very best entertainment at sea really offering Tony Award-winning full-scale Broadway productions, most of which are all going to be included in the price of the cruise. These are not snippets. These are full-scale productions, and we're very proud of them. Uh, new to Norwegian Encore is Kinky Boots, which is, uh, offers an award-winning show with music by Cindy Lauper. Choir of Men, you'll see on the top of the screen, this is set in an English pub, and our talented cast of gentlemen is going to sing a wide variety of some of your favorite rock hits and pub tunes and what, be, what has actually already become one of our fleet's top-rated shows. Continuing on uh, Encore that we introduced as well on Bliss and Joy is Happy Hour Prohibition. It's a musical as well, set in New Orleans during the Prohibition where guests get to enjoy 
five specialty cocktails while watching the show. And uh, one of my favorites you'll see is the Cavern Club. It's a venue that, that was fashioned after the famous Liverpool Club where the Beatles first became famous and where our guests get to kind of reminisce and sing along with the Beatles cover band through decades of their greatest hits. Talking about Norwegian Encore and the destinations, Encore, as I had mentioned earlier, starts off with a seven-day Eastern Caribbean cruise from Miami. It'll be touching in on St. Thomas, San Juan, and Tortola. It'll be sailing from November through the middle of April of 2020. And then it'll start a series from New York City on Sundays, doing a summer itineraries to Bermuda, as well as some select Canada New England cruises through November of 2020. And then it'll be repositioning back into the fall for seven-day Caribbean, calling on Roatan and one of our newest and most popular island ports, Harvest Key, in, ad in addition to um, some select round-trip 12-day Panama Canal cruises, until inevitably she's going to actually be repositioning and doing Alaska in the summer months of 2020. So what we wanted to touch on now that we've introduced and gone over some of the highlights and features of Norwegian Encore, we wanted to make sure you are ready and positioned with a value proposition of effective ways to position Norwegian Cruise Line this wave season. First and foremost, I know most of you are probably familiar with our Free at Sea campaign. As we continue to utilize that, it's our market to fill strategy, and we use the word free in pretty much everything we could possibly do. Again, not focusing and featuring price, but building on value. The next thing we're going to talk about is our new Affinity Groups program, and we want to make sure you take some notes on it because it is one of the most exciting group programs I have yet to see. And lastly, we're going to talk about selling to past guests and our Latitude VIP offer. First and foremost, again, the Norwegian's Free at Sea offers up to five selections, highlighted first by the unlimited open bar, shore excursion, specialty dining, Wi-Fi, and friends and family sailing free on select departures. You'll see the value proposition that this presents, the open bar, which you will not probably be surprised is our most popular selection, with over 70% of our guests choosing the open bar. On a seven-day, typical seven-day itinerary, this, um, this slide to, tells you and walks you through our shore excursions, which would include your typical four ports, specialty dining, Wi-Fi minutes, friends and family free, all rolling into the value proposition, again, of up to $2,800. So who's the, the guest to really target this promotion to? And we we like to think it really appeals to a wide variety of demographics and age groups. First and foremost, our families. You know, the kids sale free component is going to be a heavy influence to that, plus all the other features that they get value for. For couples, whether it's honeymooners, anniversaries, just romantics, going out on a cruise, the free open bar and dining package, plus all the other amenities may be a great opportunity to reach into your database and contact those individuals. And for those adventurers, maybe it's your Generation Xers or the millennials that you know in your market, which is a continuing to broaden um, marketplace that's very important for us all, they're going to be focusing on the adventure, the uniqueness of the destination, reaching out and going on those shore excursions or making sure that they're connected to be able to share those moments via picture on social media. These are going to be some of the most important features to them. So with Free at Sea, you probably notice, if you've been tuning in, that we have what we call cliffs in our promotional effort. We want to make sure you're able to leverage these cliffs as well, because Free at Sea is our ongoing campaign, and it is going to continue. We do offer from time to time various versions of our Free at Sea, such as through October 31st, we're offering all five options when you book a balcony or above, but that may not always be the case. So what we'd like you to do is pay attention to those cliffs and whenever you're ready to be able to market and promote um, effectively and easily, you have a promotion that you can count on. 
and that's in the consistency and the value of the free at sea. The cliff dates, when we're approaching it, create that sense of urgency and that call to action. So guests, your guests are not necessarily sitting there waiting and shopping. That's not what we want them to do. We want them to take advantage of booking in advance and securing their best value proposition possible. Now, as far as a hard cliff that actually is coming and will not be extended, I wanted to make sure everybody is aware that Norwegian's fly free is going to be ending October 30th of this year. Now, if you haven't heard, Norwegian is including a variety of over a thousand departures are part of what we have a free or reduced air add-on, uh, 20 gateways free to our Alaska departures, over 100 gateways free to the Caribbean, free air available to Europe or, to Europe or up to about $199 on some of our lower end dates, depending on your gateway or region of selection. This offers a fantastic opportunity to get into the marketplace and identify maybe some of those bucket list destinations that aren't that close for some of your customers that they might like to go to, whether it is Hawaii or Alaska or Europe, being able to combine the opportunity to fly at a reduced or free cost is a tremendous value proposition. We may be including this at some point in the future, depending on specific departures, but this program will be ending October 30th across the board. When you select the cruise uh, fly and free, it is also combinable with the value of the free at sea that I had mentioned earlier. So the next thing we wanted to talk about was our affinity groups. And affinity groups are absolutely one of the fastest, most effective ways to remain profitable in your business. So what is an affinity group? And we want you to really qualify it because we have a program that is carved out specific to affinity groups. We've made it a much more lucrative component and with it, there are some safeguards in the program to ensure that we preserve the integrity of our group program. So we'd like to make sure that you are qualifying what a true affinity group is. But it isn't that complicated at all. It's really only about those people that you know or people who have an acquaintance, a familiarity, those people within your sphere of influence in your marketplace that maybe are friends or reunions or hobbies Whatever it might be, they can qualify too for an affinity group. So let's talk about some of the great enhancements that we recently introduced on our affinity group program. The first thing is a tremendous competitive advantage on the standard market rates, and this being our discount. So for guests that are booking between four months to upwards of nine months in advance, when you block a group for them, they receive off the top an automatic 5% discount off the prevailing fare. Better yet, with a little bit more advanced planning, Ocean Views and above will receive between nine months and up to 15 months 10% discount when you block that group. And last, for groups that you hold, affinity groups held 15 months or more, Guests that eventually book into those groups while you have that space will qualify for a 15% discount on Ocean View and above staterooms. The Affinity Group program also combines our very aggressive tour conductor uh, berth structure, which is a one tour conductor credit for 10 berths. Maybe an easier way to think about it is one TC for every five cabins sold. This is a great way to reach out within your community and identify those Pied Pipers and group leaders that you have and give them a, a unique way to possibly even escort and travel with a group at a discount or complimentary way. This is, uh, these TC credits also can be used for anything you wish. If you want it just to go back to yourself, you want to offer various amenities across the board, it is for you to leverage and it is uncapped. So for all those cabins that you book, you earn at that pace the tour conductor. 
And the payment schedule is very flexible. We ask for an initial deposit in order to secure your space and lock in the discounted rate that we have mentioned $50 per cabin due 60 days from the date that you actually block the group. Now let's highlight some of these special group amenities and the increased value that qualifies in the Affinity Group program. Group amenities, the flexibility is great because it can be selected at the state room level. So if people have different interests, they do not have to just select, not, it's not one size fits all, there is flexibility to it. Now, for inside staterooms, we offer our, your guests the opportunity to select two amenities from the menu below, plus one bonus amenity. And I'd like to remind you about our free at sea uh, promotion currently going on in the FIT individual environment, where we would offer only one amenity. Ocean view staterooms, balconies, and mini suites get all four amenities plus one bonus amenity. In the normal ongoing free at sea environment, we are offering two amenities for ocean view balconies and mini suite, not four. This once again points to the fact of the tremendous value in the affinity group, group program. So the standard amenities you already know because we talked you through it as it relates to our free at sea type amenities. That's the open bar specialty dining, Wi-Fi and shore excursion credit. But that bonus amenity offer is in addition to uh, either $100 in the form of onboard credit, bonus commission back to you with a minimal requirement of five cabins, or a fundraising credit. Again, another tool to go, get it, to go out into your marketplace and reach out to those fundraising groups that are ever so popular. And if for whatever reason, the, uh, your guests want to do something different than just the onboard credit, there are other options listed there as well. But it even gets better, and something that we've just rolled out, and we're getting terms and conditions out in the marketplace as we speak, we have an Affinity Group Plus program on select departures. Now, we already have highlighted the, the benefit of reaching out and blocking group space in advance because of the, the significant discount off of the standard prevailing rate. But for these select destinations listed on the screen, the Norwegian Sun, which is a seven day, uh, offers seven to 12 day departures in Alaska between May and October. Um, Norwegian Joy is a seven day Alaska program offering uh, through April through September of 2020. And Norwegian Spirit, which offers eight to 24 day Asian cruises from May through early December of 2020, we are gonna allow you to block the space between, actually it's starting tomorrow and December 31st. For any bookings that materialize, Guests will have included on top of all the free at sea amenities, the drink and amenity, uh, the dining and drink amenity will include gratuities as well. There is significant value savings upwards between three to four hundred dollars and even more, depending on the length of the cruise, where those amenities are included. So you really can't get a better opportunity here. This is a great wave ready strategy for you to reach out to your customers who have interest in these more lucrative destinations and take advantage of the opportunity and put a group together on it. Our Asia cruises um, are even gonna be focused on some popular local events like the Cherry Blossom Festival, the Dragon Boat Festival, and even during the 2020 Olympics in Tokyo. So just some food for thought there. So how to book an affinity group, very simple. Uh, most preferential way is that you can maintain complete control of it is book uh, via bookncl.com. If you go into Norwegian Central, hopefully you're registered and able to book through our booking engine. You can also contact us to block your group space by the numbers listed and uh, the options there. And you can also, once the group is booked, you can manage your group online, again, through bookncl. And if you need any help or contact or questions or concerns on that, Feel free to reach out to our group teams as well as your business development manager. 
Okay, so we've covered our group program. Now it's time to talk through some of our strategies of selling to our past guests. We believe our past guests are our easiest win and the easiest and best opportunity for you to secure more business um, in the upcoming year. So we're gonna highlight a program that's extremely important and we need to make sure you're aware of is selling to past guests by way of our Cruise Next Future Credit Certificates. This is an exclusive onboard opportunity that really rewards your customers for planning their cruise again. So the idea would be maybe you have a first time cruiser to Norwegian Cruise Line. Before they go on their cruise, make mention to them of a unique way that they can get an additional or free money when they go on board. And that opportunity is in way of onboard credit. If they sign up for a future cruise credit certificate, they will earn immediate gratification on that departure in the way of onboard credit. So for $100 of onboard credit free added to their portfolio, they only need to purchase one $250 future cruise credit certificate. Now, this certificate does not mean that they have to even select what departure they're going on. It simply means that they are reserving a reduced deposit to select a future departure within a four-year window. So if they enjoy cruising, if they're cruisers, which we know once they get on board, they're gonna wanna cruise at some point again, this is a win-win situation for the guests. The more certificates, they're not even limited to just one though. If they'd like to purchase up to four certificates, we will award them on the spot $500 of onboard credit and they can receive four certificates. Now, those certificates in addition to are transferable. So for you as the travel agent, if you're looking to purchase a cruise certificate when you're sailing, you can receive the same thing and pass that savings along to a guest, sell it, do whatever you need to do for guests that purchase this Cruise Next certificate. If they're looking to give it as maybe a holiday gift or whatever they'd like to do, they're absolutely able to do that. So this is a very powerful, effective program. Better yet, when you sign into Norwegian Central, we have a new option that you can click on that will actually list all certificates that are under your profile, meaning what guests have on their, their latitude profile, we can run a list for you that will show you which certificates are outstanding. And that makes for absolutely the perfect follow-up call. They've already booked before, they love to cruise, and now they have money sitting there on their portfolio that they can apply towards their next cruise vacation. This is a great, easy way to go and close your next sale and increase patronage and loyalty to your business for years to come. In addition, when guests go and sail with us, they purchase their Cruise Next certificate, they get their onboard credit, they have their future deposit to apply, and then they start reaping the rewards of our Latitudes Club, which is our loyalty program, it offers a tiered benefits that award points for every cruise night that is actually sailed. So the introduction, when they go on and they come back, they can immediately register to be Latitude members. And on their next cruise, they already receive benefits, such as a bottle of wine, priority embarkation, and exclusive discounts on key departures that we'll talk through in just a quick moment. When they start moving up in their loyalty, such as the Silver Club, they'll get discounts on shore excursions all the way up to when they move up into the platinum level accounts as well. They're gonna start earning higher levels of discounts such as free internet time, spa discounts, specialty dining, uh, free specialty dining, and much more. So uh, the loyalty really has, a, it's a really good program and uh, another unique opportunity to, um, to increase your marketplace for future cruisers. And lastly, when it comes to our past guests, we've got our Latitudes VIP offer. This offers past guests, no matter what level of attainment they've received, up to 20% off regular rates on over 380 cruises 
listed there. These are for sailings from January of 2020 and beyond, plus it is, it is combinable with the free at sea. So now we have an opportunity similar to what I had mentioned on the, F, on the affinity group side, but even a deeper discount on an individual level for our latitude repeat guests. Another great opportunity for them to, for, and for you to identify and be wave ready, finding the list of all the available sailings, reaching out to your customers that you know have sailed with us in the past and offer them this 20% discount and very value rich free at sea offer that currently is giving up to five benefits at a balcony and above. So the value proposition is pretty simple. We've got a very diversified employment, a wide variety of itineraries. Both what we have is home ported locally in the United States as well as abroad. We've got many different options to choose from to hopefully entice many of your customers looking to scratch the next thing off their bucket list and in doing so, increase their value by the various tools that we've discussed. Norwegian's destinations also have a couple of other unique distinguishing features that no one else in the marketplace has that we wanted to call attention to. First off, Harvest Key off of Belize. We introduced this port of call, unique to Norwegian Cruise Line just a couple of years back. We consider it the Caribbean's premier island destination and it's part of our Western Caribbean destinations. And it's a very unique port of call for your customers who are really looking for maybe something a little bit different in the Caribbean, especially for those who've been to the Caribbean many times. Harvest Key is a highly, highly regarded destination that's getting tremendous reviews. You see there that's a 15,000 square foot swim up pool bar. It's got a seven acre beach. We've got luxurious beach cabanas, a zip line, a large marina with water sports and plenty of dining and bar opportunities as well. And then Great Stirrup Key, that's been our Harmark uh, island resort destination, our exclusive private island experience for Norwegian guests that sail on our Eastern Caribbean or our Bahama cruises where guests get to enjoy uh, live music, pristine beach with white sand, absolutely gorgeous and many optional activities. We've got a stingray encounter, snorkel with the turtles, a kayak. You've got uh, island cocktails in your own private luxurious cabana too on uh, Great Stirrup Key. And we've got a Bacardi and Batron bar and a complimentary taco bar and an 8,500 square foot beach buffet. And we can't go without talking about the exclusivity of Hawaii on Pride of America. We offer a second to none itinerary due to the fact that the vessel is flagged and registered in the United States. The seven day inner Hawaiian Island uh, cruise offers upwards of close to 100 hours of port time with overnights in Maui and Kauai, and she delivers an exceptional product on a wonderful ship. So the value proposition is in the growing fleet. More new, beautiful ships. What we've done in the last 18 months is actually grow by three of these breakaway style ships, capping it all off with Norwegian Encore, and then we will be continuing to invest in our customers and in the trade as we introduce starting in 2022 through 27, six brand new, completely different styled vessels. We are calling our Leonardo class. These ships are gonna be slightly smaller, giving us some unique flexibility to go to different destinations and reposition ships unlike ever before. I personally can't wait to hear about the different enhancements what we're gonna be offering on board. So we'll have to all stay tuned for towards the beginning of next year to learn more about the Leonardo class and which is forthcoming. So again, to recap, the value proposition to you, we're offering promotions that tie in value and do not encourage customers for the least expensive price. Our intent is to never race to the bottom of price. Our intent is to offer free value, build value in, in great promotions, 
that enhance the experience for each guest that goes on board. The group program that we highlighted gives you an opportunity to select and work with those within your own community that have an affinity and an affiliation with one another, get them on board with a great discount with even more lucrative, generous incentives as well. We talked through some of the exclusive destinations and the flexible offerings that we have, and then the investment in new ships and new ship builds, giving you more opportunities to earn commissions and to build a program that it's going to meet the need to a wide variety of customers within your customer base. We know your customers have a wide variety of interests. And that's why we believe between the activities, the entertainment, and the value of these new ships, it's an absolutely great proposition for your customer. And probably the most exciting thing that we can share with you is as we plan with the right type of promotions that promote value and promote getting people on board, thinking about their vacation plans farther in advance and not waiting until the last moment. What we've done is build in a package that offers higher yields, it's a higher price program, and it gives you the opportunity to earn higher commission, which is what we think is the win, win, win. Your customers win, the cruise lines win, we can continue to build new ships, and you're earning commission off of things like a drink package, like a dining package, like the shore excursion credits, because it's bundled in to the price of the cruise. Since 2014, we've increased our commissions paid by upwards of close to 30%. And that's a winning proposition. That's exactly what we want um, with this. So tools that you can use. As we uh, close it up, we're going to talk through Norwegian Cruise Line University, Marketing Headquarters, NCL Help, and Partners First Facebook. First off, our Norwegian Cruise Line University. This is an education program created just for you. We don't want to just tell you about information and leave you without other resources to learn. We, uh, we've got a variety of different core courses and electives. Um, including um, some graduate courses, many classes offering some really practical tactics on how to sell to different types of customers that we think are going to be useful. Probably my favorite thing, though, to it is that these courses are fast. They're quick. You're in and out within 10, 15 minutes. You can go through a class, and then we leave you with some printable reference material for follow-up. So it's not a long pace painstaking process. It gets high level, good information for you to use. Then we have Norwegian Central in our marketing headquarters. If you haven't tried it, it doesn't matter your level of experience. We've got what we call our promotional wizard that with a couple clicks of a button, you can create an entire marketing kit, such as an email to forward to your customers, a social media post, a web banner, videos that you can download, and this can take only just a couple clicks, a couple of minutes. Highly encourage you to try to leverage this because these are high-impact promotional pieces that are sure to gain the attention of your customer base and give you a consistent brand feel that you can push out whenever you're ready to market to your customers. And this last thing, you can't really see here, but this is NCL Help. Make sure you log into NCL, I'm, I'm sorry, Norwegian Central, where we have NCL help. This is a Google-like function. We use this internally. So anything that you're curious about as it relates to Norwegian Cruise Line, those common questions that you can't possibly know off the top of your head, simply go to NCL help, type in the question or the topic, and you'll get a list of various explanations. We use this internally. It's our go-to resource. We hope you can make it yours as well. Again, it's all about making it easier to sell and promote. Our Partners First Facebook page, if you haven't liked it, please do. You're going to see a lot of unique, good material, the latest and greatest. Also, some social media positioning on how we feature some of the promotions and campaigns might give you some very good tools to use when you want to feature in your social media strategies 
whatever week that might be. With that being said, I just wanted to say thank you. Um, I hope this has given you some good thoughts on how to get WAVE ready. Probably the most important tool, though, I would like to encourage each of you on, your, on the phone is to connect with your business development manager. They are our eyes and ears. They work with hundreds of people every year. They are brainstorming and talking to and planning, and they have ideas. They have marketing um, opportunities they can do with you and a couple, all the tricks of the trade. So if you don't know who your business development manager is, we encourage you to connect and identify them. Easiest way, once again, is going to Norwegian Central, log in there and find sales contacts, and there you'll be able to better identify who your key point of contact is. We hope you'll reach out to them and be wave ready. Put your plan together. This is the time to do it, and we look forward to you all having a successful 2020 wave season. And with that, I'll pass it back over to Anna. Sure, thank you so much. We have some questions coming in. Our first one is from Alessia, who's wondering if there is an additional cost for laser tag, the escape room, and the racetrack. <clears throat> yes, um, so yes, the laser tag does have an additional cost to it. Um, we, we've had additional costs on Bliss and Joy. I believe it's about eight to ten dollars. I would have to double check to get the current rate on the Encore. Um, and I missed the, the second question after the uh, the laser tag. What was the second one? Uh, the laser tag, the escape room, and the racetrack. Yeah, so the escape room is part of the Galaxy Pavilion, and that is a pay-as-you-go um, within each of the virtual reality games that are offered. So, yes, that, the racetrack, those are additional charges. On board the vessel, too, there are some packaged programs that enable you to have several of these things included, but there, there are costs associated with it. Okay, got it. Our next question also about the AR Galaxy um, is from Christine. She's wondering if it's handicap friendly, if someone in a wheelchair can do it. Yes, there are opportunities for that. So there is accessibility to it. Most of the, um, of the gaming equipment is headsets that let you kind of freestanding or wherever you're located in the area. So there's going to be some that you, you that may offer some challenges if there's some climbing to it, but most of them will have headsets that can kind of be removed off of the base location of where it is and can uh, and offer some versatility as to where um, the person can stand and be located. Okay, perfect. Our next question is from Gita, who is wondering if there is a sailing list for the Affinity Group Plus program. Um, so, yes, it's up for all 2020 departures on the products Norwegian Joy to Alaska, Norwegian Sun to Alaska, and 2020 Norwegian Spirit to Asia. All of them are eligible. The terms and conditions have just come out. So stay tuned to our Partners First emails, our Partners First page for more information on any of the other details in the official terms and conditions of the program. Perfect. This next question is from Elliot, who is wondering if there are incentives for solo travelers. You know, the incentives that we really have for solo travelers are in the cabin accommodation type that we offer on many of our vessels that we, um, we introduced what we call our studio stateroom. And the studio stateroom um, takes away that single supplement that most are used to paying where they're having to do double occupancy rate, and it is actually a studio cabin. So we, make sure you're familiar, you learn which ships offer the studio accommodations because they're one of our most popular they sell out the fastest. They include a studio lounge for people to get together, gather around. They have coffee, tea, snacks in the studio lounge, and they have their studio accommodations. Um, exceptionally popular, offer unique value, especially for that. It's a, it's a great market for us, and uh, we've been able to take advantage of that 
think we started that off with Norwegian Epic and have introduced that on many of our uh, newer ships as well. Okay. This next question is from Raquel, who is wondering if any of the Alaska sailings include inside sailings in Glacier Bay. We do offer Glacier Bay itineraries, yes. Yes, we do. We are going to be having Nor between, uh, we mentioned Norwegian Joy, and we also offered Nor mentioned Norwegian Sun, but we also don't want to forget that the uh, Norwegian Bliss is also sailing on a round trip Seattle itinerary as well. I know there, this, the Bliss has been extremely popular and newer to the market has been Sun and Norwegian Joy. But yes, we do offer some Glacier Bay itineraries. Great. Jennifer is wondering when the first real photos will be available of Encore. The first what? The first real photos. Oh, the first, instead of just renditions and so forth. Um, I will have to follow up on that question. Okay. I'm sure people are anxiously waiting. We have just a few more questions. Really quickly, we'll get to them. Uh, this is from Barbara, who is wondering if there is a flight discount when booking with a group. The flight discounts that were mentioned um, today that are expiring October 31st are not combinable in the group environment. It is an FIT promotion. So just keep that kind of compartmentalized. If you are looking to leverage that, uh, make that your FIT promo you know, promotion. And then for the affinity groups, for your group campaign, make you know the affinity group has so much value in it as well, but they're not combinable. Got it. This next question is from Anthony, who is wondering, with the affinity groups, is there a maximum number of cabins that you can book? So maximum number of cabins um, we allow is up to 199 cabins. If by chance you look to go over 199 cabins, the terms and conditions may change. It would have to be reviewed. You want to talk to your business development manager with that because it may um, require a different set of arrangements, terms, and conditions altogether. But for the purposes of the group, you have the opportunity to hold an affinity group up to 199 staterooms. Perfect. And it looks like this will be our last question from Margo, who is wondering if there is a payment plan for individuals sailing on the Bliss. An individual payment plan option? Yes. Uh, yeah, we do have a program um, that we recently introduced. I would like to follow up with it because it's kind of new for us. Um, and I don't have a lot of information right at my fingertips about it. So if it would be okay, Anna, I can send you over details of that program. Of course. Okay, and that was all of our questions. I want to thank everyone so much for joining us and thank you, Zach, for all of the information. It's been my pleasure. It's been a lot of fun, and I thank uh, everybody who was able to tune in. We really appreciate the support and the partnership, and we wish everybody a wonderful Q4 and wave season. Have a great rest of your week, everyone. Bye. Bye now.